Welcome back to the Sixth Kitchen, where Tom Dunn is frantically trying to take <laughs> the powder from milk teeth off his lips. I'm here with Tom Dunn, of course, Brandon Donnelly, and Owen Sheehan. What yeah. are we doing tonight, my friend? We are doing a spice bag. So this is one of Ireland's most popular takeaways. Can we have a hands up for everyone who's had a spice bag? Right, okay, yeah. just yeah. me myself. Just let's, yeah. let's go. I, I, mine was market research. So I had to test around, see, see what they were like. Okay. And this is my alternative. So it's a lot healthier. It's made at home and uh, it's, it's, it's so, so easy. Okay. So spice bag, it's chicken and... It's chicken and chips, basically. Yeah. It's tossed in like a Chinese five spice. Uh, it would traditionally be like deep fat fried or shallow fried in a pan, whereas we're going to bake them in the oven. Look at this. Yeah. Look at this. So, yeah, yeah. Look at this. Good. That won't wreck it now, will it? No, not at all. It'll make it better, would you believe? He makes really. Yeah, yeah no, yeah. he's going to make it work. So, the chips are the first thing. So, if you don't mind, I might give you this. I've one done already. Joanna. So, and did you say something about was it your mother or your mother in law being excited? No, about my you? mom is going yeah. to be delighted. So, that's the side that you're looking for. In the cook. Yeah. There we go. So, you do so what we're doing. You can, you can follow on from me there, and I'll, I'll start breading the chicken. Very sharp. Oh, Please be careful. Yes. yes. So you're. Yes. Can I do it my way. Just what we yeah, need. Perfect. perfect. Good big chips. Yeah. So the chicken itself. What I've done is I have some breast of chicken here. I've just diced them into nice kind of goujon sizes. Yeah. So we're gonna make a batter. And you so want chicken breast and do, chicken thighs? Uh, either one will work. Bone and chicken thighs will work as well. Yeah. Uh, the chicken breast is a little bit healthier. Just for this, we might as well go all out. I thought, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Go with the thighs. Uh, but thought, the, thigh, the yeah. thighs are nice as well. Healthy. Uh, there's a little bit more fat in the thighs. Mind. They're a little bit more flavoursome. I would have thought. Okay. So we have two eggs. Here, I'm just going to crack them in. This is going to add to our batter. I'm just give them a quick beat with this. That's perfect. Thank you very much, Joanna. Okay. Do I need to chop on? And Joanna, uh, bring you, you can. You can carry on with the onion there. So do you want that chunky, or do you want it? Yeah, chunky as well. Bite. So chunky. if you go half once, drop them on its belly, so it's safer to cut. And then you might just do five incisions across there then. So to oh, make he's, he knows size. what he wants, right. Cesaro. Years, years at it. Like there that. we go. So for the chicken, it goes into the flour. So this is going to help stick the egg. Goes okay. into our egg. This is my wet hand. This is my dry hand. Very good. So the wet one goes in. He knows Just that it looks. And then every into second. our. So these are panko breadcrumbs. Okay, so this is what they are here. So they're like a Japanese breadcrumb, and I've added some of the spices to it as well. So do you need to have those, or can you have? You can have normal breadcrumbs bread crumbs as well. But the key thing here is that I've added a teaspoon of the Chinese five spice, paprika, and cumin as well. Five spice, paprika, and, and cumin. cumin. Yeah, into yeah. the, so into the, the breadcrumbs and mix it up. Mix yep. it all up. Yeah. So, so then, and this is the sort of thing that you could get your, if you gave them gloves, you could get your children to do it for Exactly. Them. Yeah, of course. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Give so them that's a job. What we're doing. Them busy. I like this dry hand, wet hand, because I've done this. I've made our own chicken nuggets, yeah. but I didn't know, I didn't know about the dry hand, yeah, wet yeah, hand. Yeah, so all I had was messy hands. Yes. So, so all we're doing good. is just coating these up. I can speed this up now, which I've done one. And I like that Owen had to think himself there a second. He was oh, like, which one is it? So it's dry <laughs> hand, wet hand. I very strong, and in the end, it's just two hands trying to get it's it just going together. like that. That's so good. Ah, and so also, in, from the point of view of climate, you're not wasting plastic with plastic gloves. Exactly. Isn't that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Absolutely. There we go. Very good. Oh, so dry good hand. Thinking. And you're also I'm gonna make a bit preparing of a mess fresh food instead of buying processed, yeah, which is massive. Completely, which is always All we're doing is just putting these into a baking tray. Yeah. Like so. So you keep on breading all of this up. Yeah. Again, wet, dry into this. Get so kids you learn something new want. every day. Yeah. Don't There's a very bell good. pepper there, Joanna. So if you oh. want to yeah, don't, dice don't that. Stop there now. I know you know which way you want this. Can I do it my way? You can, of course. Go on. You can, of course. Do your thing. Go off. chunky bits again. So you keep on going with yeah. all of this. Yeah, yeah. I'll and just then do two more now. That you're making the yeah. chips. So then, yeah, we're going to dice this all in our spices and then just bang it into the oven. So it, it couldn't be easier. All, this is literally the hardest part is what I'm doing now. Just breading the chicken itself. So again, it's the sort of thing that you can have pre-prepared. Oh yeah, yeah, for, for sure. Family yeah, yeah, or yeah. For, it's kind of get it done when you can get it Absolutely. done. And then it's Absolutely. just easy to go into the oven. Okay. So it is, the, it is the much healthier alternative. It is, yeah, yeah. No, you could, you could shallow fry this in like a, if you had a frying pan, add, you know, a nice glug of oil and just fry them off. It would yeah. work as well perfectly, but the fact that everything's going into the oven, it's going to be roasted, it's, it's just, easier, it's just as easy. Okay, we've got about a minute, two minutes left on this, so what, so what do you need perfect. to do to finish so it off? Our potatoes go in beside this. With nothing on them, just straight no, in? No, we, we will, we will, oh, we will. We'll dice it up in but a they're second. But they're all going in with the chicken? That's perfect, that's perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. everything's going to go in. So into this, here, we are going to do a glug of olive oil, just so okay. it doesn't stick. This is... Over the potatoes. It doesn't, it's not time consuming at all, really. No, no. Great. And you can do a big batch of this as well. So, you know, you could do a couple of portions. So, this is Chinese five spice. You want to oh, smell very that? Very good. 
Yeah, I love that smell. Is that what that they use? Is, yeah. Anis, is, it anis, yeah. is there aniseed in it? Or? There is, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's a mixture of all it's of them. Very licorice. So you can smell it. Some yeah. paprika, mm -hmm. some cumin, and this is a bit of fajita mix. So I'm going to pop these all over. There's already some in the breadcrumbs as well, so you don't have to go too, okay. too much with that. That is pretty much done. Give it a twirl. This goes into the oven. And then, and I think Kwan Jae, who comes on the who comes on the show, Kwan Jae Chan, he's got like a, a five spice or or a spice bag sort of a mix yes, as yes, well yes. that he does, which and is great. And when it comes out, okay, how what's the heat looks. in the oven? So that is 200 degrees for 30 minutes. So you'll be watching you'll be watching your chicken and watching your roast potatoes, but you want the kind of nice golden brown color on them. You so know? in all yeah. fairness, the preparation, this is very simple. Yeah, it is. extremely. Very much so, yeah. yeah, Very much so. So I'm going to take so off. Chips in it, which are one of our favourite things. It's yeah, got chips. Exactly. Ray's yeah, going to yeah, be happy. Yeah. It's got chips. You're delighted. Yay. So, well, yeah, so there we go. So this, there's a few ways that this can be plated up. It can be on plates. It might be given in a bag, it's a spice bag. Yeah. Or very often, it's given in a big pizza box. So they'll throw a load of them into a pizza oh, box okay, and yeah. it's, it's oh, shared yeah, pizza. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. there's actually a little bit of arts and crafts involved here as well. I was very, very busy for about 35 seconds this morning. Very. And Look at this. Very <laughs> own, our very own 6 o'clock show, six pizza, box, show right? pizza box. Can you see that there? 6 o'clock show pizza box, guys. So I'm just Ray's going to be delivering yeah. just after 7 o'clock tonight. He's yeah, this is shift from Just Eat. I think he's, he's the head off. Perfect, this you can now. do it. So let's have some fresh chilli. <laughs> we'll pop this open. Like so. So this is what they'll usually do. So you'll see we have our nice, crunchy, Something. golden yeah. chicken. Yeah, yeah our golden crispy chips, and then we have our onions and peppers all roasted in there as well. And so then just throw it in. in. As it a smells like a nice batch. It, it smells amazing. It smells lovely, the onions doesn't it? Great. Yeah. yeah, the yeah. best thing, and like, especially yeah. when you're roasting those vegetables, they go super sweet. Yeah. So you, you nearly want to kind of char them. I mean, like, they do look a bit black and brown, but that pulls out the Oh, completely. The and, the and it's a communal thing, the way you're kind of doing this that, here. We're going to finish. That's kind of what, what I love about it. We've you got all this. sweet chili, you have a chipotle mayo, you throw it up in front of the whole family. I'm allowed to do this. You go you for it. Indeed. Go for it. It's sugar, a family the thing. Sugar's gone We're going to have. So I'll go for some You're fine. Now. Go with like, it. Ray's hanging right. out over in the couch. He's been looking at your comments as we eat this. I have been looking at more than the well. comments. Let me tell you. I'm Deliveroo by, by the way now, lads. Not uh, just eat. I've moved over to Deliveroo. <laughs> uh, I love Bernard Casey's video. This is Bernard Casey was on us a couple of minutes ago with the teeth in his, with the milk teeth in his mouth. I love his uh, Bernard Casey's videos, especially local gossip. Uh, I didn't know he was doing live shows. Yes, he is. Live shows. Vicar Street, February 29th, Castle Bar. On the 14th of March, and when Lisa says, "What dress is Warren wearing? What dress is it? Is it Little Woods one of them?" It's Little Woods. She'll, she'll put it up on the the oak afterwards. Keep it on, on Instagram. Warren's instant. She'll sort you out there, Lisa. Uh, and your your injuries. We'll get to them in a couple of minutes. We've got loads of them. Stupid ways you hurt yourself, like me doing the splits last night. We'll do those in a few minutes. Uh, more of them uh, on the way after the break. Uh, you still have a few minutes to get them in, and we'll chat to you more right after this. Bring it over.